In today's feature video, we're looking into a common headache for many drivers. Check engine codes related to MAF sensor issues. So, sit tight as we explore what these codes mean and how you can address them with confidence. Let's get started. In today's cars, the Mass Airflow Sensor, MAF, is a component that monitors the precise volume of air entering the engine, ensuring precise fuel delivery and combustion. It keeps tabs on how much air is zooming into the engine, making sure it gets just the right amount of fuel for smooth sailing. It's an important component that provides data to the engine control unit, ECU, so it can facilitate optimal engine performance by regulating the air-fuel mixture with utmost accuracy. So when the MAF sensor encounters issues, such as malfunctioning components or inaccurate readings, it automatically communicates it to the ECU. In response, the ECU will generate a series of check engine codes, which will serve as diagnostic indicators for technicians and mechanics. Among the most common codes associated with MAF sensor issues are PWO 101 to PWO 104, and at times, PWO 10A to PWO 10D. These codes are indicators of potential concerns regarding the MAF sensor's functionality, range, or input signals. To understand it better, let's examine each code individually and how they relate to your vehicle's functioning. Codes P0101 to P0104 typically indicate issues concerning the MF sensor's wiring. These problems may include issues with the sensor's range or performance, abnormal input signals, or intermittent faults within its electrical wiring. At the same time, these codes could also send signals that are too low or too high. Sometimes it might just act up every now and then. P1001 indicates a problem in the MAF sensor's airflow readings. This is often attributed to sensor malfunctions or issues within the air intake system. Technicians typically conduct a thorough inspection of both the sensor and the air intake system to diagnose and resolve this code. Now. P0102 is a Diagnostic Trouble Code, DTC, indicating a mass or volume airflow circuit low input. This is triggered when the MAF sensor detects a lower than expected airflow into the engine. Usually it's because of a faulty sensor, wiring issues, or air intake obstructions. To address this code, technicians typically conduct a comprehensive inspection of the MAF sensor, its wiring, and the air intake system. P0103 is a DTC indicating a mass or volume airflow circuit high input. This occurs when the MAF sensor detects a higher than anticipated airflow into the engine. Potential causes may include a malfunctioning sensor, wiring issues, or blockages within the air intake system. Technicians also conduct the same process as they do with P0102, then, P0104 is a DTC indicating an intermittent mass or volume airflow circuit. This is triggered when the MAF sensor reports irregular airflow readings to the ECU. Common reasons for this irregularity include sensor malfunction, wiring faults, or restrictions within the air intake system. Technicians also conduct the same process they did with the other codes we already mentioned earlier. On the other hand, Codes such as P010A to P010D often indicate similar issues, but they specifically target concerns associated with the manifold absolute pressure, MAP, sensor, which collaborates with the MAF sensor to optimize engine performance. So these codes typically pop up when the sensor is not working right, there's a problem with the wires, or something's blocking the intake manifold. It's worth noting that both MAF and MAP provide data to the ECU for regulating the air-fuel mixture, thereby ensuring efficient combustion. Now, if the MAP sensor is not doing its job properly, it can indirectly impact the performance of the MAF sensor, which in turn affects how your engine performs. That's why it's important to sort the issues out as soon as you can to keep your engine running smoothly. If you're wondering about how the MAF sensor can get damaged, well, it can happen for a variety of reasons. Common causes of MAF sensor damage include contamination from dirt or debris, electrical faults, or mechanical issues. Additionally, 
These issues with faulty MAF sensors can result in engine performance problems such as rough idling, poor acceleration, or even engine stalling. If you encounter these check engine codes or notice any signs of MAF sensor issues, it's important to get your car checked out by a qualified mechanic. At the same time, knowing what these codes mean can help mechanics in diagnosing and addressing MAF sensor-related issues efficiently so your engine keeps running smoothly and reliably. Keeping your MAF sensor in top shape keeps your engine running smoothly. After all, a healthy MAF sensor means your engine can breathe easily, which translates to better performance and fewer trips to the gas pump. So, make sure to keep an eye on it and get it checked regularly by your trusted mechanic. It's a small step that can make a big difference in how your car runs and how much you spend on fuel in the long run. There you have it, the common codes for MF sensor damage. If you enjoy videos like this, make sure to like and subscribe so we can assist you fix it.